To start measuring, double-click on the thumbnail of the picture you wish to measure which would open an editing window. Check the scope for the magnification value. Then input the magnification. Press the measure button to find customization options. You can adjust line properties such as color, style, width, and transparent color. You can also adjust text properties such as color and font. You may also set the units to millimeter, microns, mils, and inches. Click on the measure button, then line. To start measuring, left click the mouse for the starting point. Then another click for the ending point. Lastly, place the results where you want it, and click again. Here is another example. Left click for the starting point. Again, for the ending point. And place the values where you like. Start measuring a continuous line by selecting Continuous Line from the menu. Left click for the starting point. Again, for the ending point. Then place the results of the first segment. Continue measuring for the next segment. Place the results where you want it. And repeat. When done measuring, right-click on the mouse and select No Draw on the menu. Then finish by placing the total length where you prefer it. Select the Polygon option in the Measurement menu. I am going to draw a triangle for my example. Start measuring by left-clicking at the starting point. Click again to finish the first segment. Place the results for the first segment and continue measuring the next side of the polygon. Place the results. Close the polygon to finish the measurements. Place the last results, then select a place to put the total measurements. Select radius circle to start measuring the radius of a circle. Start measuring from the center of the circle. Then end the measurement at the desired location. Lastly place the results of the measurements. Select diameter circle to start measuring the diameter of a circle. Left click for the beginning point. Left click again for the ending point. Now, place the results where you would like it. Select three points circle to measure a circle by selecting three points from the parameter of a circle. Start by left clicking on one point of the circle. Select another point. And end the measurement with the third point. Now, place the results where you would like it. Select three points arc to start measuring an arc. Start by selecting one point of a chord on a circle. Select the other end of the chord. Now place the last point that is tangent to the arc of the circle. Finish the measurements by placing the results. Select three points angle to start measuring an angle. Start measuring from the pivot point. Left click for the second reference point. Left click again for the third reference point. Now finish by placing the results where you want. Select four points angle to measure an angle when the pivot point is not clear. Start by measuring from two points of reference at one side of the angle. 
then the other set of two points from the other side. Finish the measurements by placing the result. Hopefully this video has helped you learn more about the measurement features on the Dino Capture software.